Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back with a brand new video into my channel, Apex. So, guys, now I'm back with a mind-blowing setting of the Fortnite, which will, guys, completely change your gaming style and, guys, improve you into the Fortnite like a pro. So, just, guys, make sure to watch this complete video. And, guys, this video is contained like into the three parts. Like the first one is the best settings for the window, which will, guys, help out you to reducing your input delay and, guys, increase your response time in your game. I also show you the best settings for the Fortnite, which will really help out you to boosting up your fps and also improve you into the competitive arena matches so guys just make sure to stick with this video till the end if you want to become pro into the fortnite so guys without wasting any time let's go straight into this video So guys now here I am on my PC and now I am going to show you how can you choose the best resolution which will guys really improve your gaming experience into the Fortnite. So guys for this if you have the Nvidia GPU or the AMD GPU so guys you can easily create the custom resolutions. So just for creating the custom resolution you need to go into the Nvidia control panel if you are the Nvidia users and just follow out my these steps. So just open up the Nvidia control panel go for the change resolutions scroll down and here is our customize button. Just click here on this button, go for the create custom resolutions and from here guys you need to just create a resolution by the 1600 by the 900. So just type here the 1600 and onto the vertical line just type here the 1900. So guys now here is the bonus step for you. If you have the 60 hertz monitor so guys you can just overclock your monitor onto the 75 hertz and it will guys not do any type of damage on your monitor or your, on your LCD. So just you need to just type here 75 hertz and you can easily convert your monitor from the 60 hertz to 75 hertz and you will get the best response time into your game so just after doing the setting just click here on this test button so guys i have already created this resolution and i also play with these resolutions and also guys you can check it out here i have the 75 hertz on my the 60 hertz monitor and guys this video really help out you to giving the zero input delay and give you the best response time into the fortnite so guys now just click here on this ok button just close it go into the display settings and guys from here you need to just select out the custom resolution which we have created now which is the 1600 by the 900 so guys for the sake of this video i'm recording it onto the 1920 by the 1080p so guys just use this one Next guys, after just doing the settings, you need to just download a software which is the IFLC, stand for the standby list cleaner. So I will give you the link of that software into the descriptions of this video. So just go there and download this software. So I have already downloaded it on my PC which is the IFLC. You will see here, here it is. So I am just going to open up this folder and here is the intelligent standby list cleaner. So just right click here and run this as administrator and guys this interface will be show up on the screen. So just click here on to enable the custom timer resolution. Just type here 0.5 and just click here on the start button and minimize the software in your background. So just after doing it close out this folder and guys still the software is running in our background. Now you need to just open up your Epic Games launcher and launch out the Fortnite. So guys now here I am in my game so now I am going to show you the best settings for the Fortnite for reducing the input delay and increase the response time into the Fortnite. So guys first of all you need to just go into the settings of your Fortnite and from here just go into the full screen and select out your new custom resolution which is the 1600 by the 900. So just select out this resolution and lock out your FPS onto the 160 FPS or according to your machine. Like if you are getting this table 120 FPS so just simply set it onto the 120 FPS. Just after doing it you need to just scroll down and make sure guys do this setting properly on your PC. For the graphic settings you need to just select out your 3D resolution onto the 100% and just guys increase the view distance onto the epic from the settings. Now here is the most important setting which is the texture settings so guys make sure to set it onto the high just after doing the setting you need to just scroll down and just also follow out my these settings from here. Enable the director 12 which is the beta version so just use out it and also guys turn on the allow multi thread rendering from here and just set out the nvidia reflex low latency onto the on plus boost so guys just after doing the setting go into the gear icon and also guys 
disable out all of the replays which is recorded by the epic games automatically so guys you need to just also turn off these replays so just guys after turning it off apply the settings and guys it will give you the best response time in your game so guys just after saving out the settings you need to guys just simply jump into your game and guys enjoy your gameplay so guys now i'm just showing you what the setting this will do with your game and with your gpu so guys simply when your gpu is not 100 percent used or utilized so guys it will not give you the best performance of the input so guys therefore i'm using the setting which is the view distance and the texture on to the high so guys it will guys help out your gpu to using the maximum use of your gpu from the 80 percent to the 100 percent so guys it will guys increase the response time and the performance of your game so guys i hope so after watching out this video you will get the best performance into the fortnite so guys till at the next video allah hafiz and bye bye